Hey guys, we're back with another episode of Taco Imposters. Okay, I was just watching a, Bil a Billy M episode. I think it came out like a few hours ago. Anyway, and he was talking about okay, something that was really cool. Okay, I remember this as a kid, okay? Because, I'm going to tell you, my best friend for like five years, from when I was like six to... Four or five years, between like six and ten, anyway, was a girl. Okay, so I did a lot of curly things, but this thing was really cool. It's called Pixel Chicks. Okay, if I can get it, maybe I'll put a picture up. I don't know, but um, it was like this cool. Um, it was basically what, uh, a lot of the LCD stuff, right? And it came out in two thousand five, and it was a little bit late to the party of LCD things. But at least they did it much, much better than a lot of other people did. Oh yeah. They did it better. They, they know what they're doing because it looks better. Because basically, instead of having just a static screen and then things change behind it, it was a physical static screen. Like a physical screen behind it. Or a physical, like, background of, like, a dollhouse or something or a car or something, right? And then, like, a see-through transparent screen. I honestly... Honestly, I was like, that's actually, it was actually a cool thing, because they did it much better than a lot of other things did. Which, hey. It was because I had something called, or I didn't have, my brother had, something called Neopets. I don't know what they were, what, like, their subtitle was, but it was like Neo, a Neopets thing. Like, electronic like, Neopets, which is basically a Tomodachi, but you chose an animal. My computer's been... Blue, blue screening forever. Colonel. Colonel security check. Colonel. Hmm. Hmm. That's weird. Anyway. My computer's been blue screening recently. The last two days or something. Anyway. Um. Yeah, so that thing was cool. Okay. So, like, uh, um, yeah, they were cool. And you can put them onto, like, a dock and put them onto the TV, these, like, Neopet-type things. Which, I mean, they were what they were. They, they weren't the greatest thing ever, but they were cool. For what I, I remember wanting one. I didn't ever get one. My brother had got one. His best friend had one at the time. His best friend had one at the time. Best friend at the time had one. Oh, nuts. Now it's saying repairing automatic repair. Yeesh. Hope that's not screwed with my computer. Can I take a drive and put it into this old computer? Because the drive does have SATA, but I don't know if it has the power, the right power. No, I don't think it does. I might have to use this, uh, I don't know if I could use this, uh, power supply. Ah, dang. Okay, anyway. But yeah, it was a cool thing. I mean, personally, I like, I thought it was interesting, but I don't know if I, I don't know. Jeez Louise. It just restarted. Like, it re... It preparing automatic repair. I'll leave it for a second. I don't know what's going to happen. Oh, no. Anyway. But they were cool. They were cool. I mean, they were cool enough. I don't know what... They were really... They were decent. They were decent. I mean, they weren't the best thing ever, but they were cool. They were cool. Let me just turn the light on. Just like, I'll be right back. So there's a lot of those kind of things, though. And then William also, Billy um, also did a video on uh, cube, cuboids, is that what they were called? Cube world? Anyway. They were basically, it was just a cube, and it had a little stick man in it. And I, I remember having one. And a lot of these things, and I mean a lot of these things, were all marketed as like, look at, you can have multiple to connect, yeah, connect together and multiple friends, and it's great, it's amazing. It's so... Oh, there you go. Yay! Well, I don't know. Maybe blue screen again. My computer's been working. I don't know if it's working. Anyway, but yeah. So they were all touted as like, look at the, like, connect, like, you can connect together. It's great. And then it's just like... Right? 
But then, I never had them, so... <laughs> I think my cousin had one, one, had another one. Or my second cousin had one. Is it second cousin? Or is it once removed? I'm trying to remember... The children of your cousin are your second cousins, right? Or your second... Yes. I believe so. Anyway. The children of my cousin had them. Had They had them. Uh, he had one. He had one, I think. And it crapped on me. Ah! Same thing. Colonel. Security. Check. Failure. It blew screens on me. I don't think it's going to work. I knew there'd be a problem with this computer. I, I, I freaked with it. Now it's just... Uh, anyway. But yeah. So. And I think he had... Like, I remember... I remember him having one. But I don't know. Anyway. So, yeah. I mean... um. Yeah, so he, I think he had one, and I remember connecting it. Or my friend had one, maybe. Please wait, okay. Um. But anyway, I knew, I knew I connected two together, at least once of these cuboid ones. And I, my brother and his friend, best friend had connected their like Neopet thing together. He never got the weird like connect. Okay, recovery. It looks like Windows didn't load correctly. If you'd like to restart and try again, choose. Oh, restart. Let's try restarting. Let's try restarting. I don't know. Don't tell me that drive's dead. Don't tell me that drive's dead. Please don't tell me that drive's dead. Oh, that would suck. That would, that would really suck. I don't know. Anyway. Dang it. Oh, well. But yeah. So they connected them together. And they played. I They did. I think theirs was like infrared or... I think. I think. If I can remember correctly. Because I don't remember cords. And I don't remember connecting them physically. Like through like... You know, um, what are they called? Like, um, um, like pins or anything? Like, header, like, you know what I'm saying? They didn't, I don't think they did that. So, I don't know, but those things are cool, honestly. And, and, and now the Pixel Chicks is cool, because the Pixel Chicks was like a, a better version of like, I don't know how to explain it. It was a better version of like, really bad LCD things, you know? I loved LCD games. LCD games... See, it loads this, and then it's gonna crap on me again, isn't it? I have no idea. Is it? It bing, 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 bing! I don't know. Anyway. So, yeah, it, it did that. I mean, not that. It's gonna crap all over me, isn't it? It's gonna try and run, try and open, and then... Crap. Watch. Watch, watch, watch. It's not gonna open properly. Anyway. So, yeah, they were decent. And, yeah, and I looked for them again, and I was just... I looked at them again, and, and they're not exactly, like, cheap, per se. The Neopets are not expensive, but... It's that small window, or it's not window, but small, like... Like, ah, crapped again in the security kernel! Ah, yeah. Kernel security check failure. Dang. Turn this thing off. Turn it completely off. Now, what's what kernel? Anyway, but yeah, so there it's that weird group of people where like it's because certain things aren't aren't rare, aren't ex sought after necessarily, aren't expensive, but there's just enough people to make a small group of people. Who make it just like a stupid amount of money, like like a like amount that you just don't want to pay. Like I'm not paying, you know, twelve dollars for one. But you know, it's not a bad price. You know, that's that's what happens with me a lot. I'll look at things and go, it's a fine price. I just don't want to pay that because like I don't want to pay twelve dollars for one. Like, and can you know that, that there'll be some bum somewhere, you know, some bum somewhere who will just be like, oh yeah. You will put it for nothing. Absolutely nothing. We'll do it for absolutely nothing. So. Yeah, so. You know, it'll do it for nothing. So. You know that, like. Or not nothing, but you know, like, much cheaper than. Okay. Please. Work. It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. Computer's not gonna work. Watch. But anyway, so yeah. I never really necessarily looked at at 
the pixel chicks, because I, 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 I've forgotten about, oh no, I kind of remember them, but I never really ever cared much for them. So, I was like, oh yeah, those are really cool, and then like, Billy made a video, and people brought it up, and I was like, oh, okay, they're actually not as bad, they're actually really cool, they're actually much cooler than I remember them being, well, No, actually, they're about as cool as I remember them being. It's not crap watch. Stupid things. Anyway. Actually, now that I think about it, they're just as cool as I remember them being. Because they were... They weren't that... Bad. But they were... I don't know, something about them that were just cool. Like, they were just, just as cool as I remember them. Because I remember them just being like... Because they were never the greatest thing ever. But they were better than, like, a lot of those L3D things. I had L3D think of the wazoo. I think I talked to... No, I talked about McDonald's Happy Meal. And we got onto uh, L3D stuff in that, like, McDonald's Happy Meal thing. One of these, uh, uh, podcasts. But, um, there were a lot... A lot of them from McDonald's. Quite a lot of them. Oh! It's, it's doing something. Just changed to the uh, uh, what's that called? Night, night, late, night shade, night, night shift, whatever it's called. When it turns, oh, yeah! Thank you. It ran properly. Computer working. And then, apparently though, when I try and, and do any video editing, it craps. The whole thing just craps. So I'm using my mom's laptop to edit these things now. So, oh yeah, and I forgot to say, today is sa Sunday, October fourth, twenty twenty, and this, this camera, okay, the, f technically the front facing, but I've made this the, the primary, ca uh, camera, and so it says that that one's the back one, but anyway, the opposite of the one I'm using now, I dropped the camera yesterday, and now it's got a little crack in it, and I don't know, I went on a walk with my parents today, down to, uh, what is it called, oh, he said that, my dad said the name of the town we were in, like, five times, and I don't, and I didn't connect it into my brain to remember it. Anyway. And and I don't know if... Because the only thing I'm concerned about is... Because I don't even care about the scratch necessarily. <laughs> necessarily. All I'm care worried about is lens flare onto the, the, the one part of the screen. No. Which is bad. But anyway. But, I mean, hey. This camera... Okay. Is getting old, too. It's a Samsung... Galaxy S, no, sorry, Samsung Gear 360, 2017. Uh, uh, hey, my dad, because I asked my dad, you know, it's between four and five hundred dollars. Because I think that's about what some, what the one I'm looking at, the new one I'm looking at is. Um, I'm looking for a for a Insta 360 R Duo, I think it's called, or yeah, I think it's Duo or something like that. Anyway, the one that's an action cam and the thing and the and a 360 camera and um. It, it, what's it called? What's the word I'm looking for? It, you cannot, I didn't change the lens and it's great. Um, it's an action camera and a 360 camera. Anyway, it's going to have a sale for, for Prime Day, which is the 13th and 14th of October, which they said it was going to be 70 bucks off, but they don't tell me what the price is yet. So at least they don't say anywhere. This price, at least as far as I've looked, I've looked at it and whatever. But anyway, um. So yeah, that's what I'm looking at. It's about between four and five hundred dollars. And he goes, "What's the difference so between this one and that one?" And it's like, there. It's not that it's bad, and that's that's the thing. It's not that this camera is bad. It's adequate for most people because most people don't know what g good is. They don't know what you know good is. They just like, oh, that looks so cool and impressive. Like, it's the same thing with like. It's the same thing of whoopsies when someone says something like. There was like photos or videos when someone just showed you them and you're just like, but, you know, oh, it looks amazing. It's like, yeah, but you don't know what good is. It's what people argue when they use things like red cameras, right? And, and then, and they're just like, no, but like, you, you've seen one and you'll be like, this is the first flip, flip and fantastic, like this is the best thing ever. And I'll be like, and I'm always like, mm, I don't see a difference here. I don't see a difference between 720p 
1080p and 4K. Now, okay, of course, I see a difference between 720p and 4K. It, I can see, like, I can tell the difference, but I don't, like, see, like, oh, this merits me to buy a $45,000 camera to buy, to use, no. Stop it. You know, no. 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 Not for me, at least. So, anyway. So, yeah. That's just my opinion. You know. Anyway, so like, that's the thing. I I've seen people show things like really good cameras, like the like the nice high end, ca like higher end cameras than this. This is always a budget, consumer entry level, like consumer entry level stuff, and it was never meant to be anything great, and they never made it to be great. It was just like, hey, here's a cheap, and it was like three hundred dollars at the time. So I mean, it wasn't necessarily cheap, but now. Because that's the thing, I, I looked at an Instagram post by, was it Insta360 or just someone had 360's name or Insta360 in the name or something? I don't know. Anyway, and they were just talking about, is it still good to buy this? And they go, entry level, you have no, well, first of all, for the 360, you have a, right? Have a, what's it called? Have a, uh. Samsung phone, or you have a three. You have the second one. Um, yeah, the the twenty seventeen, and you have a um, iPhone. That's the only two phones that'll work. Right. Then yeah, it's decent because it's you have if you have no like knowledge of the stuff, no three sixty anything, no. No. I didn't pick this one. Just a sec. Okay. Just a sec. There you go. These things. These were cool. Okay. So anyway, um, if you don't have any of that, and you don't have, uh, and you don't have any knowledge, and you don't have any like photography skills, and you're not, you don't know any of that kind of stuff, and you don't have any tech, techno, tech, like. You're not sab tech savvy, really. Then yes, this is a good camera still to buy because I don't, I don't know if they said that in in that post I was looking at on Instagram, but what a lot of people said was it was cause it, yeah, and personally I think it's good to buy still in 2020 even though they're they're uh, discontinuing support for it and the app is just the app is going to be crapped and gone anyway, right? Even though even though. I think it's still good to buy because you can get it for so... You can get it for, like, dirt cheap now. And you want an entry level... You want something better than, like, a... What's that thing called? A cl uh, cl panel clip? Which is a thing that you clip onto your, like, iPhone. They had it for iPhones. I don't know if they have it for anything else, but iPhones. You, you know? And then, um, if you want it be uh, for better than, like, that, right? And you want it better than, like, just a random app that will take, like, two pictures, right? And you want it better than, like... Things you collect, connect like those really cr not they're not that bad from what I've seen. Things you connect into like your your uh, lightning port or your like micro USB port or uh, USB C port. You want something better than that, right? But you're not willing to spend like you know uh, the 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 Insta or the Theta One R's and like the Insta uh, Insta Three Sixty uh, not Max Insta Three Sixty. Duo or our duo or whatever, you're not ready to get like that kind of stuff. Right. Or you're not willing to spend like um, the other good one that somebody was playing to me on Instagram because I was talking to somebody there in the DMs and he was talking about uh, which one was it? It was the uh, Ma uh, GoPro Max. And you know, that's a really good camera. Well, his argument with that camera was he bought like he bought it for like six hundred or something, and then paid like three hundred for or two hundred something, something ridiculous, in my opinion. But he bought like protection for it, and basically that protection was like he could smash it into a million pieces, smash it to dust, and and have no like evidence of existence of remnants of this at all, and they would just give him a new one, like replace it, with, which he was like, you know, so for him. Like you don't have that money, which is six sixty nine, 
uh, Canadian on Amazon. And about the same price if you go directly through uh, uh, GoPro website. Yeah, that's a good camera to buy. And some but, uh, people are still arguing though that the first one was better than the second one. Because the sound is slightly better and there's sl slightly different things. And there's removable batteries in the first one. So, and on the removable battery though, I can definitely tell that mine has definitely gone down in battery. Because I could get about an hour and like t 10 minutes, some 20 minutes, depending. See, an hour, an hour and a half. Right? And I, when I was used to do, last year, when I used to do uh, the 360 videos here, watching stuff, holy moly, like, I could get an hour and a half. Now I can only get, like, 45 to maybe an hour. Maybe. More like 50-something minutes. Anyway. Um, yeah, so. The battery, I can tell, is going down. My, and that just could be not necessarily overheating battery, because it overheats all the time. I think it might be overheating rather than degradation of a battery necessarily but it has gone through like a couple of cycles about a couple of dozens i don't know if it's a whole dozen cycles but it's gone through a couple of like cycles maybe half a dozen cycles maybe a dozen i don't know but and okay if you don't know a battery cycle is when it it's a hundred percent and then it dies that's one cycle and so they always like you know tell you okay um Where it's like, they always say like, okay, it has like 3,000 cycles or 100 cycles or 50,000 cycles or five, th five cycles, you know, and batteries, you know, for rechargeable batteries. So, but yeah, I can definitely tell for that. But I don't think, I think the second one's better because of the whole fact that you can connect it to an iPhone and a Samsung. And I like the form factor better. And the quality, it's weird because certain parts of it are better. I think the pictures are better, but the, uh, the video is better, but the pictures are not. Is that right? I think so. The, the megapixels are lower or something. Anyway, something like that. And the sound is not uh, not better than the, the first one. But, hey. Which is weird because they made it, they, 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 they gave it um, live streaming capabilities. And then made the, the sound adequate to the first, to, to the 2016. Anyway, I don't know. I don't care. Samsung has no... Intention of doing anything with these things. They're done. They're like, I'm out. We're done. 360 cameras, forget it. We're, we made two. We're done. We're out. At least as far as I know. Freaking five, ten years from now. Th three, five, ten years from now. They could make a new one and say, hey, we came up with a new 360 camera. Anyway, I don't know. Anyway, this. These are pixel checks, okay? See? Now you're going to hear that, but I'm going to cool it down. Sorry. Cool down this thing. Yeah. So these are pixel checks, and they are, I'm sure some people have used these, played with these, I'm sure. See, I played with this one right here. I think, I believe so. And I played with the car. Now, do they have the car in this? Yeah, there you go. Well, it's not a very good picture of the car, but that's the car. Where is it? Can you show me a, there, that thing. There you go, that one. That one, or this one. I didn't have the mall things. I didn't have the, like, all the other stuff. I didn't, I just had, and I didn't have any of these. I played with these things. I think it's exactly the one I played with, honestly, right there. I think it's exactly the one I played with, right there. I think that's exactly what I played with. And then, probably that exact color of card, too, probably. Or with more pink, I don't remember. Anyway, I don't know if I even, if you even see that. But anyway, yeah. That's actually what those things are cool. But yeah. So, 360 cameras, videos, I don't know. Anyway. So, hey. <laughs> 360... I don't, I want to get in 360, and then I need monopods, and I was looking at getting a, because cause yesterday I dropped it when I was get, when I was looking at getting a tripod for it, like a Joby, like, gorilla pod. but I was like, do I want a gorilla pod for, like, first, because, or do I want a, a monopod, and I was like, well, first I'll look up what, what people say are good monopods for 360 cameras, like, what people use, what, all that stuff. Second, I'm going to see what this deal is for the for the Insta360R Duo, whatever, yeah. You know what? You know? Right? Why am I using... No, I feel like with that one. Yeah. Yeah, I believe with that one. 
Yeah, okay, anyway. Yeah, so, I'll look at that. And I'll see all the stuff first before I do. Because I'm like, oh, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, so yeah. I'll want to see what those are first, so yeah. Anyway. Yeah, um... Uh, yeah. So I'll see what that stuff is first, and then I'll look into, like, getting one. Because I, I don't know which one I need first, because... Because with mo uh not monopods with the uh, yeah monopods I can use it for if 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 the camera still looks perfectly fine well, not perfectly fine but like fine enough to use I can still use it for like um virtual tours and stuff so I'm not because I want to try and get to do virtual tours because there's places I would do virtual tours that I would get to do anyway but yeah so yeah so I don't know anyway. So yeah, that's that. And then, yeah. See, now it's the Halloween season. And I want to watch... Okay, on Instagram I watch a movie. And I want to watch a movie every day. I've already missed two days. I watched them last night, but I already missed two days. But I watched them last night, which was uh, Night of the Living Dead. And <laughs> Instagram is so stupid in regards to, like, when it, when it, when it comes to, like, um, their live videos because features are only apparent when you do certain things. So, like, like I can make a live video, do a live video for an hour, and then if I want to save that live video, which I can do, I have to stop that live video. I think it's true. It might even be a thing where after a certain amount of time you can't save it. Like, if you go for, like, a full hour, you can't save it. Which you should just... Once you get that part where it's like, dude, 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 it's like going down, like, oh no, you only have a minute left, whatever it is. They should, like, it should just end and then have that option. No. I think that only works if you, if you, I'm not even 100% sure, but it, but I think it only does that if you stop it before you get to that point. Which to me is just like, but, but, but why? What? Ugh, I don't get it. I don't get it. I just don't get it. And you still like, you like, keep it up for like 24 hours. And I was like, I can do that, right? But then it won't let me do that. Now that option isn't around, I don't know. It's stupid, it's dumb, it doesn't make sense to me. You can save these videos too, you can like, download them, save them to your camera roll. But I never have space on my phone, so I never have, can never do that, but anyway. So yeah, what were they saying? Yeah, so, anyway. They're, it's just dumb, anyway. But yeah, so I want to watch a movie every day, but realistically I'm only going to get to watching a movie like, the week of October, or week of Halloween, probably. Because I'm, I, I'm probably watching random movies here, like, scattered in between here and there, but I don't think I'm going to get to watch, like... I don't have 31 movies, okay? Yeah, I missed two days, so I don't have, like, 28 movies, 27 movies. Because last night I watched Night of the Living Dead. And that's a good movie, that's a good movie, Night of the Living Dead. It's very simple, because there's, like, there's virtually nothing to that movie. Spoiler alert! I'll give you, like, five seconds, spoiler alert. They literally, there's there's nothing to that movie. It's just oh, we're stuck in a house. That's it. We're we're stuck in a house. That's it. That's it. We're stuck in a house. Oh, trying to get away from the zombies. And then we hate each other. We don't like any of the, us in this house, really, really. <laughs> and then at the end, when everybody dies, everybody dies in that movie. Everybody dies. But actually, does everybody die? Yes. 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 Everybody dies. So I'm trying to remember. Does the one, does the first girl, woman, whatever, does she die? I'm trying to remember. Yes. But I don't remember how. The guys in the basement die. The couple in the basement die. The two couples in the basement die. Ben dies. And then I don't remember how the girl dies, but I'm pretty sure she dies. Anyway, but yeah. So. Anyway, but ugh, it's a good movie. But there's like nothing to it. But it's good. It's good that way. It's good that way. It's, it, it's just simple. It doesn't doesn't overcomplicate everything. Because a lot of horror movies overcomplicate things with weird, like, um, 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 mythology to these, like, creature-y things. And it's just like, oh, God. You've got to, like, you've got to kill it with, 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 with. With the 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 ring, I don't know, like 
like the ring finger nail of a of a North Flying Pygmy Marmoset or something. You know, you know what I'm saying? Like no, or North Facing Pygmy Marmoset or something stupid. Like, or it's got to be the 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 root of the 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 wolf bane, but 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 grown on the north side of the Eastern Peninsula on a full moon. While the planet, while Jupiter and and Venus are are in retrograde, and, and oh my God, it's just ridiculous stuff. That way, it's not the worst, but it's just annoying when it gets really complicated and how to either kill them or like the lore, the war story of these things, the lore of these things, these mythologies of these things. Oh God, it drives me nuts. I like how they just never explain, and also in that movie, I love how they like how they never explain how anybody becomes a zombie. None. They're just like. Uh, we have no idea, really. We just know that they're going crazy, and they're doing like they're getting, they're dying, and then turning into these weird zombie creature things. We we don't know what's going on. Is it a virus? Is it a is it a a disease? We don't know any of it. It's great, right? And then and then uh. uh I love how they're just like, at first, they're like, oh, well, uh, stay inside in all costs. And then, like, later they're like, well, because this is the authorities, right? Because they're, they're, they're listening to the radio, and then and they find the TV. And so they're just like, stay inside in all costs. Just stay where you are. Stay huddled up. Stay bundled up. And then they realize, they're like, oh, wait, maybe getting away from these things would be a better idea. So, like, get to these, like, secure... Um, or what do they call them? They call them, like, bunkers, I think, or, like, uh, re re uh, ref not refugee, like, rescue, I don't know, whatever they're called. But, yeah. <laughs> it's like the whole, like, they didn't know what was going on either. They're like, eh, eh, you know, they didn't know what was going on. The authorities are like, I don't know what's going on. And I love how, like, the one of the guys that comes up from the basement is just like, Oh, the, the bad guy was named Mr. Kirby or Mr. whatever his name was. Anyway, the one who just doesn't want to go up, really. Anyway, <laughs> the wife. Because he goes down, okay? And then he tells the wife, well, like, there's nothing useful up there. Like, they even, they had a radio, and she, she literally goes, radio? What are you, a nut job? We need the radio. And then he's like, what? and then she, and then he kind of, convinces her, like, we don't need that. It's not that useful. And he goes, well, fine, what were they saying? And he's like, and he's just like, well, I don't know. They just know mass murder everywhere. Like, but what is it? What's going on? And he's like, I don't know. What he knows is just mass murder everywhere. Anyway, so, so yeah, I want to watch more movies. So I'm probably going to scatter a bunch of just random movies in here and there, but I don't know. I'm going to actually watch that many movies. I know I'm going to watch movies from um, the, the week of of Halloween. I know that. And I have the first one and the last one. I know what I'm going to watch. For the first and the last. But other than that, the first, the last, and two in the two somewhere between those two. But I don't know what else. So, yeah. Anyway. Yeah, so. Yeah, I want to do that. And then, yeah. So, good stuff. That, that, the one I watched last night was good. It was good. It was good. It was good. So, yeah. Halloween. See, but I'm not a big horror movie fan. I'm more of like a Halloween movie fan. So, there's like, Oh, I got three, uh, f uh, five, uh, I've got five movies now. I need two more. I need two more movies for that week. Got it. And I want to play lots of video games too. I know I have a few video game like games to play. One I played as a kid, which I really like. Well, I don't know. Actually, when I think about it, you know when you like, you know you have nostalgia for something, but in a purely nostalgic I played as a kid way not in a this is actually a good or bad video game you have no you're just indifferent different towards the thing like you don't have like a, oh oh such a good game and you're like you just like it because you because you have nostalgia for it and it's like yeah maybe but I don't even have that like oh nostalgia so I like it no I just have this like weird I physically played it I don't particularly think it's a good game or a bad game. Even with the nostalgic of like, oh, I 
hated it as a kid, so therefore it's a bad thing, and I never, you know, or like, oh, I played it as a kid, so I love it, like, because a lot of things that I've watched that were both either bad, and I think they're decent, because I watched them as a kid, or good, no, I think they're good, but they were really bad. I just said the same thing, didn't I? Bad, but I thought were good. Or good, but I never liked. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. But yeah. So. And, and this game is very... It has that, like, I don't care for... Like, I don't know if it's good or bad. I don't have the nostalgic... Like, oh, it's good because I played it. No, I know. So. Yeah, so. Yeah, and then I was trying to find things like... Like Scooby-Doo, right? I was like, but where do you... Like, and I was thinking to myself, there's lots of these random... Some movies... Some movies, but, a, but mostly TV shows, where it's like, where do you watch some of these TV shows? Like, I'm looking at one now, right? I was transferring Smallville, because I got it from my mom's friend. I got, not the whole series. I got ten seasons, nine seasons, anyway, of Smallville. Uh, there's like twelve or ten, maybe? I don't know. Anyway, I don't have them all. All I know is I don't have them all. Anyway, get, I was watching Smallville, like, getting Smallville, right? And Smallville... Right. It's one of those shows where it's like, but where am I supposed to watch that if I wanted to watch that, right? I have lots of, almost the whole season, series, almost. So I could watch that. But where am I supposed to watch? But like, and then there's things like, uh, yeah, shows like Friends where like, or Seinfeld where it's like, okay, Seinfeld's on, uh, and I think both Seinfeld and Friends are on, uh, if I'm not mistaken, or on the, um, Netflix, so it's a bad example. But what I mean by that is, like, they're always on TV somewhere. They're always showing episodes of this show somewhere. So even if there was no way of watching them, you could always find like little episodes here and there and what 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 not, right? So, but I have the entire series of Friends, so you know what's the difference, right? Right? So I... So it's fun for me. But I get... I want to watch it on freaking DVD. Not really. And I got these things from my mom's friend. And I... And I, and I or I think of my dad. Or my mom. I don't remember which one. It might have been my dad. I asked like... What did they do with this? So like... You got it? You're trying... You're like... You, you did... Like... I'm transferring them all... Onto this... Hard drive right here. Which... I... It's uh... Just changing... Um... Is it form? Or media? Whatever. Oh media or whatever but like it's you're allowed to have a different co like version of it like different form of of it anyway like you're allowed to have it on a if you rip it i don't know anyway but yeah so i, I put them onto that drive and then it's like okay you've done that now what are we supposed to do with it and like because my mom's friend was like you could sell it you made like five thousand dollars on it it's like yeah if you had the next 10 years of your life i don't have 10 years of my life to just be like yeah Yeah, yeah, no, 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 really, like, and she was right, if you had the time to spend to do it, I don't, so therefore, I was just like, I don't want to, 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 and what do you, how are you going to sell them, you can't sell them at, like, the price that you paid them for them, because you look at some of them, and they're like, nineteen ninety nine. some of them, it's like, oh, god, that's ridiculous, which, well, it's ridiculous in this day and age, because, like, you can get them, like, on Netflix, so what's the point? Who'd want? I mean, there are those people. Don't get me wrong. There are those pe few people, like my best friend, who would love to have the series on their shelf. Right? But, uh, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. Shelf, right? But are they gonna buy a series? I have, like, or something? Five? It's ridiculous. I had the whole series of 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 X Files. I have the whole series of Friends. I have the whole series of West Wing. I have the whole oh, not almost the whole series of 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 Smallville. I have 
first three X Men. Oh yes, first three X Men. I have the whole um, Planet of the Apes movie series. Like Jesus, Louise. That's already one, two, three, four, four full series. Okay, four full series. Oh, Mad Men. That's five. I think it's a full series of Mad Men anyway. Like, good. Good gosh, my god. It's ridiculous. It's a lot of series. They, they all want to buy. Like, would you find enough people to buy them? It's like CDs. My dad has so many CDs, right? Probably about 150 CDs. And we're just like, and we're like, sell them all. My mom's trying to say that, sell them all, right? And I was like, sell them all. But then I looked on like places like Facebook Marketplace and Kijiji, like that, and it's just there's a littered with them because nobody wants them yet. Because that's the problem with it. We haven't hit that same thing with with both the vinyls and the cassette tapes. And cassette tapes haven't even gotten to that the same point as vinyls have. But but vinyl, you know, the, where the vinyls did the thing where they came back and like everybody everybody wants one. Like oh, they're so cool now. They're relevant. My best friend claims that vinyl is... Oh, sorry, cassette tapes are doing the same thing as vinyl. I'm like, eh, not to the same extent, though. And he's like, okay, maybe not, like, as much, like, as, to the same extent as vinyl, as vinyl, like, as records, but... As records, but... There's still records, like... No! Whoa, no, 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 no. They're still pretty... Oh, it's not. Still pretty, uh... Like, they're, they're gonna come back. It's like... No, it's because, like, two or three of the bands that he he listens to have put them on cassette tapes, and I'm just like, so that merits cassette tapes come back? Well, hey, man, certain places are trying to make comebacks. Like, shut up. Not, not that's a bad thing, but shh, just don't. No, it's not. Stop. <laughs> you know, just... No, 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 no. Anyway. So, yeah. But, like, yeah, CDs haven't done that. So you wait five, ten years, and they, they... Oh, they will. I think they will. Oh, I think they will make a weird, like, comeback that way. Well, but the problem with that is... You... Okay, you know what I think is going to happen? You know what I think is going to happen? You're going to make a comeback like that, and then people are going to find out things like Disc Rot, and they're going to go, oh... Uh, and then they're going to, like... At first, they're going to particularly, like... It, it, see, it's not going to last long because... Oh, no, wrong place. It's not going to last long at all because it's going to go like this. There's a peak. It's going to go up. But people will want CDs again. And then people will find out there's disc rot and then go, okay, so now does your disc have disc rot? And they'll start asking this stuff. And then they'll just give up. They'll be like, no, this is stupid. This is legitimately the worst. You know what I mean? They'll be like, no, I can't do this. I'm done. Like, no, 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 no. This is no. You know what I mean? But they won't, they, they couldn't, like, they won't be able to, like, they'll just give up. And so it'll last, like, I think it might, you might get five years out of it, out of this new resurgence. Because the, the, the vinyl resurgence has been, like, about 10, maybe 12 years. That's, well, from what I remember, again, I didn't, I was too young to figure out whether, like, 15 years ago it was doing a thing, or a comeback, but... I know, from what I heard, it was people, I think, if I'm not mistaken, I might be wrong on this completely, I heard something, don't quote me on this, but I heard something of, uh, who was it, it was Jack White bought a, I think he bought a, 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 vine, like a record plant, I don't know where, don't ask me, but like, record plant. I know his albums are, are on vinyl, and just people like to put them out on vinyl again. There's one in, is it Alberta? Or, or British Columbia? And then there's one in the States, like Detroit? Or like, not New York. Michigan, maybe? Anyway. Yeah, so. That had a big resurgence, as far as I know, like 10, 12 years ago. And it's still huge, like huge. Everybody wants vinyls, right? Record, record collections, right? Records have record collections. Anyway, and tapes, kind of, but not even close to the to to records. So I think 
I think. At complete best, you might get five years out of the CD guys, because that's the thing. People will, will hear about this rot, and then ever, and then because because they'll be they'll be willing to like, okay, okay, do they have rot? Do they have rot? Oh, okay, gotta check these discs and that disc and these discs and that disc. And I think by that time, there'll be more. It'll be more prevalent disc rot, and so you'll have a lot of people like, okay, do you have disc rot? And then people will just give up, like, ah, oh, it's just too much work. I don't want to ask people if they have disc rot. And a lot of people will be like, I don't care. Because it's a difference between the the records and the CDs. Like, records will never physically degrade the same way. But, I mean, physically degrade, like, just literally leave it there and it'll physically degrade. Like, that's the thing with CDs. CDs will just sit there and then just physically degrade. Like, you can do nothing and it'll be gone. It will be gone. I mean, it doesn't do the same thing as the tapes where either a VHS tape or a audio tape cassette um, will physically degrade over time playing it, right? You play it more and more and more and it degrades down. But it has a physical degree. Degrada- it has physical degradation in... You, know, you can leave it, leave it there forever. This disc right here, I leave it here and eventually over time it'll physically degrade to the point of unusability, and, and this is also really, uh, a, a burn, like a, a, CD, a DVD-R, so it's a writable, so therefore it's it's not great. So it, this will degrade faster than like a real pressed disc, but still, the law. It's just a matter of time. That's the thing. There's nothing you can do about it. It's just a matter of time, and that's it. That's all. So, oh well. Yeah. So, which is the the scary thing when people have with with video games because they're like. But all my video, my disc-based video games will just degrade. It's like, yeah. Will just cease to work. It's like, yeah. No. You know, people are like, no. That's the other thing, because they spend lots of money on it. So I'm like, oh. Where an NES game, Super Nintendo game, a Genesis game, a Super uh, Nintendo 64 game, none of those, an Atari game, none of those will physically degrade the same way. Now the chips stop working, the, the capacitors, the resistors, all that stuff stop, like, leak and all that, but they will never physically, the traces, or the, the traces, the, the connection, the pins, they slot into your system, will never physically degrade the same way it sees. Anyway, so I think you might get five years out of that. I could see a resurgence in like five, ten years, but I don't think it would last very long, because people would find, would figure out disc rot, and then just be like, <gasps> So I'm trying to figure out where to watch certain things. That's where I was getting out with the disc stuff and the CDs and the whatever. Right, 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 right. To watch things. And so it's things like um, Scooby-Doo, right? And it's like, where do you watch Scooby-Doo stuff? And Billiam, right, he had been um, 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 sponsored by things like Verve. And he was doing things about Verve. And I think it's VRV. And I looked up Verve. It's like a streaming service. And it sounded like exactly what I wanted. But then I couldn't because it was in America. So I gotta get a VPN. So I do have a VPN. I just don't know the password to uh, log in. So I uh, gotta change that. But yeah, because the VPN through a a email client. And so I was like, oh, okay, great. And then I forgot the password to the email client. And that's the thing. That's the problem with... Oh, that's, I think that people are going to have a big problem with that. You're going to hear that. where Because my problem is I have an app for this, this email client. And the email client, right? The email service the client... The app just is always signed in, right? And so you never have to worry about ever signing in, which is good. But then you forget your password, and you're just like, you want to go on like, on your browser, you know, or on your web, yeah, web browser. And you're like, oh no, I don't know the thing. And with this one, it's 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 all about security. And so if I, I, because I can do end-to-end encryption, right? So I can put a password on an email, and then they have to have the password to unlock it, right? To open it, unlock it, open it, whatever you want to call it, right? And so for me. That sounds like a great idea. So I was like, okay, great. And it's end-to-end encrypted. Even if you don't, it's end-to-end encrypted from my end and their, to their end. And they they claim that, like, you can even proton mail. So even, that's what it is. So even if they, like, um, even if you're not sending it to another proton mail user, like, right? Apparently they have the ways to, like, encrypt it even to, like, any other email. Anyway, 
not going to do that. Like, if I want to reset the password, it's going to delete all previous emails. I'm like, I'm like, no, but I'm like, I'm like, no, but, uh, wait a sec. Do I actually really care? Like, is it really that big? I don't know. Yeah, so, hey, what are you going to do? So I have to just reset it. And I'm like, but I could do that. What do I have in the past? I, I need, really, right? Do I need some of these emails? I don't know. Anyway, so yeah. What was I going with that? Email client. Encryption. What was I going for? Yeah, movies. Oh, yeah. That's the, uh, the VPN, so I gotta do that. And if I do that, I got it. So anyway, but yeah. So what was I? Yeah, so. First, yeah, so. There's so many places. I want to watch some of those. And there's just some TV shows. They're either too short. Usually it's too short or too obscure. It's not, not usually long. Or when it is long, it's usually they don't have the full series. Oh, they don't have, like, first season or something. Or they don't have the last season. Or they don't have, like, anything past this. Or they only have up till this. Or they don't have before this season or something, you know? Which, I don't know. Anyway. Like, animes will do it a lot. Where, like, if they're really long animes, like, you know, Naruto or... One Punch or, or One Punch, One Piece, right? Some places will never have all of it, so, but, or mangas, mangas where, like, they don't have the first issue or something, like a library or, like, a, um, what's it called? Like a bookstore? Yeah, I want to find places to watch. Tell me what I, okay, so, guys, I think that'll be it for now, guys. So, tell me what to watch, what to do with this 360 camera, as long as the thing still looks okay. From the crack. Um, or from the, yeah, scratch or crack, whatever you call it. Um, tell me what to do with the camera. Tell me what to do with the podcast, what topics. Tell me what to do, what to watch, you know. What Halloween stuff to watch, what Halloween games to play, then what Christmas stuff. And then just games in general and things to watch and all that. Um, and then, um, what else? Yeah, and then, tell me. Yeah, and then there's, okay, if you want to get in contact with me, there's the email address. TacoImposters at gmail.com. Um, there's the Discord and the Patreon. I'll link in the description. You want to see better content? Support me on Patreon. Be a Patreon. Be one of my Patreons and you'll be good. You'll see a better quality camera, more stuff, better audio, everything. You'll be good. Be good. Be good. But, you know. Yeah, so. If 10 people, 100 people gave $1, that's $100. If 10 people gave $5, that's $500. If 10 people give $10, that's $1,000. Or sorry, it's $100. Yeah, $1,000. Hey, you just, need, you just need 10 people to give $10. And that's $1,000. Is that right? Are we doing the math correctly? I'm very bad. Yes. 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 So, yeah. You know what I mean? So, hey. So, anyway. Yeah, a thousand. thousand dollars. Yeah, a thousand dollars. So, hey. You just need to be a lot of people. And you get some stuff out of it. It's pretty good stuff. You know? Uh, I think that'll be it for now, guys. So. Adios, mi amigos. <laughs>